hello everybody welcome to walgreens we are back for some great deals for the week of march 26 through april 1st can you believe it we're ending the week on april fool's day we have purex this week 379 we do have a dollar digital you can use for that and of course you can pick up the purex pack the purex crystals that digital also applies to that or the purex detergent the final price after that digital you'll pay 279 Gillette Foamies, $3.79. Buy one, get one 50% off. When you buy two, you're gonna get a $4 register reward. I picked up my two Gillette Foamies. One is at $3.79. The second one is at $1.89. Here you go, there's my receipt. I used a $5 store coupon to pay for that. My subtotal was 68 cents, 74 cents after tax. That's what I paid, 74 cents. And I got back my $4 register reward for purchasing two of the Gillette Foamies. The Thai Simply products are four for nine this week, as you can see right here. These are all of the items that are included, the 60 count bounce dryer sheets, the, the Simply Thai detergent, the 4.3 ounce Downy Unstoppables, or the 40 load Downy softener. Now we do have 50 cents digitals for the Thai Simply detergent and the Thai Simply pods. So pick those two up, that's a must. Pick up any other two, items that you choose to out of the five you'll pay eight dollars for my tie simply deal i'm going to use this five dollar register reward the same one i use with the gillette foamy um deal the store coupon with the 250 cents digitals that'll bring my total down to three dollars that i'll pay out of pocket for that fantastic detergent deal i picked up my four items my simply tied you know i'm a detergent person i tell you all the time so i just picked up the simply tied pods and the detergent Four for nine, as you can see right there, minus the 250 cents digitals and that five off store coupon that brought my total down to $3. I used Walgreens cash and paid 33 cents. I missed the deal yesterday on my Walgreens best deals video. Oh my goodness, y'all. The game products are four for 16. The flings are included, the detergent, the game fireworks, the game softener, and the dryer sheets, so pick four of them. These are the four items I picked up, four for 16, but I have a dollar 50 digital for the softener, a dollar digital for the detergent, a dollar digital for the flings, and a dollar digital for the dryer sheets. You can substitute the dryer sheets for the beads if you want, I just chose the dryer sheets. Minus those $4.50 in digitals, I'll pay 11.50 out of pocket for all of this. Here's my gain deal. And the way that I had my coupons, there was no mixing or matching, except um, I could choose between the dryer sheets or the beads. I got exactly whatever my coupons were, um, were you know, what they were for. Now, some of us may have a dollar fifty digital off of the dryer sheets also. I only got a dry uh, dollar. Some of my accounts I have a dollar fifty for the softener and a dollar fifty for the dryer sheets, but then I didn't clip the other coupons. So this was the only account that I clipped all of the coupons. And here's my receipt. That's the four for sixteen. I used my four off of four coupon from last week's deals. Dollar fifty digital and my three dollar digitals that left my subtotal seven fifty. I used four dollars in Walgreens cash and paid four forty nine. They are just cheap detergent deals all around this week at Walgreens. And of course, we have our deal of the week on the Arm and Hammer products, the pods, Arm and Hammer pods. If your store carries them, there they should be included too. But it's buy one get two free, and my store is priced at seven forty nine. The snuggle products this week is $4.49. We have a $1.50 digital we can use with that. The snuggle beads are also included, bringing that total down to $2.99. The all products are also $4.49, and even that one that's on clearance that says $5.49, that should come up as $4.49. Using a $1.50 digital, pay $2.99. You'll have to pick between the snuggle and the all. You can only use a digital Let's one. Let's pick up our free oral care this week. I'm gonna pick up one of the toothpaste to price at $3 because when we buy three of them, we're gonna get a $5 register reward. And then I'm going to pick up two of the toothbrushes priced at $3 and I have those right here. Here's everything we picked up. I have a 
digital for the first toothbrush. I have a, another $2 digital. When I scanned the app, two of them popped up. So I don't know if it popped up today, but I do believe the first, this digital right here, you had to have clipped yesterday when I put up that video to tell you about the best deals of Walgreens. And then we have another $2 digital for the toothpaste. That'll take off $6. We'll be left to pay $3 out of pocket. Plus the tax, getting back a $5 registry award, making that a $2 money maker. So this is how this worked out, y'all. Picked up my three items at $3. As you can see right there, I have three $2 coup digital coupons that came off. Two for the toothbrush and one for the toothpaste. That left my subtotal of $3, $3.74 after tax. That's what I paid. And I did not get back a $5 registry reward. I got back a $4 registry reward, but it is a manufacturing registry reward. I did the deal again, the Oral B deal and the Crest deal. And here's that receipt. Same thing. Printed out $4 registry reward. It still ends up being free and a dollar money maker subtotal. Um, but yeah, there's, I was talking to them. There's just nothing that they can do because it's printing out the reward. They don't know if it was a misprint on the tag, even though the ad does say, um, you get back $5 registry or there's just nothing they can do. I'm over by the L'Oreal and we have some clearance going on. Don't forget that we have a 10 off of two digital you can use for that. Plus a two off of two IVC coupon that'll take off an additional two dollars so that'll be twelve dollars off of two and they're buy one get one fifty percent off plus spend 25 get seven dollars back in walgreens cash digital booster on the app i'm gonna pick up two of the uh, l'oreal lipsticks on clearance at my store 9.99 buy one get one half off 14.98 minus that 10 off of two digital and a $2 off of two IVC coupon that brings my total down to $12.98 out of $2.98 out of pocket. Sorry, $2.98 out of pocket is what I have to pay. But you have to keep in mind that two off of two digital is Walgreens money. So we can't count that amount towards the spend 25, get $7 back in cash rewards digital booster. We'll have to replace that $2 that we're using on that IVC coupon with something else. I'm just gonna have a ton of lipstick, y'all. I'm gonna get to $25 with the L'Oreal lipstick. I have a five off of one digital that is also attaching for these matte tays and a four off of one digital. So I'm gonna pick up two more at $5.49, buy one, get one half off. I also have foundation on clearance, blush, and some other face products and mascara. So I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get some all clearance items up to $25 and then we're just gonna go over this. Okay, this will be the first part of my spend 50 deal. Get the $10 in Walgreens cash. Plus I'm pairing it with the spend 25, get $7 in Walgreens cash on cosmetics, digital booster. I'm gonna pick up the L'Oreal face product priced at $14.49. The L'Oreal Age Mascara will be, it's $11.49, so it'll ring up half off at $5.49, hopefully. The lipsticks are all priced at $5.49. I put the $9.91s back. The second one at $5.49 should be $2.74. Altogether, I have $36.96, give or take, in change. Using that $2 off of two IVC coupon, it'll take off $6.00. Then hopefully the three off of one digital will come off for one. Uh, the five off of one digital will come off for the second one. Then I have another five off of one digital, I believe. A 10 off of two and then a four off of one. Hopefully they all come off. Y'all, that's what I'm calculating for. Super cheap makeup along with that two off of two. But if you notice when the two off of two digital came off, I was at $30. So I'm still spending $25 in cosmetics getting back that seven dollar cash reward i'm also going to pair in the olay it's by three at seven dollars each which will be 21 dollars. get a five dollar register reward part of the weekly deals 
that should push me over the $50 so I can use my 10 off of 50. We do have a five off of three digital that'll bring that down to $16. Now, if you do it on its own, you can pay in Walgreens cash, but I'm pairing it with the spend deal, so I'll use cash. Here's everything I'm picking up for my transaction today. Spend 50, get $10 in Walgreens cash. Pair it with the, spend 25 on cosmetics, get $7 in Walgreens cash. Pairing with the paper booster, spend 40, get $9 in Walgreens cash. That should give me back $25 in Walgreens cash, if I'm not mistaken. I'm also going to get back a $5 registry reward for buying three Olay. The bar soaps are included. I have that five off of three digital for the Olay. Then I have a $4 digital off of a face product, I believe, or a $5 digital. I'm just going to throw out all the digitals. I have a $3 digital off of the mascara, a 10 off of two, and then I have a couple of other coupons. I'm not sure if they're all going to come off, but I'm definitely going to give it a try. It's better to do this deal online because you know the coupons will come off. In store, it is a hit or miss, but I'm going to give it a try. Plus, I'm going to throw in these $15 in register rewards. So all together, after all of these coupons and register rewards, I should pay $9.69 out of pocket. Don't forget, we have that two off of two digital Walgreens store coupon. We cannot include that in our transaction. That is why my total was $57.69. After that takes off $6, I'll be at $51.69 still over the spend 50 threshold getting back 25 dollars in cash rewards for all of my paper and digital booster and a five dollar register reward let's go check out okay here's my spend deal now you know that didn't go exactly as planned some of those coupons did not come off and really my 969 total should have been cheaper than that i missed some coupons adding it up because it was so many of them but i was trying to be realistic but here's everything. As you can see, the IVC coupon took off a dollar off of all the L'Oreal products. One was at $14.99, and I believe that was the foundation. That's the mascara at $5.74, and then all of my lip um, items. There's my Olay at $21. I was just adding up some stuff right there. There's my paper booster, spend 40, get $9 in cash rewards. $5 digital. I'm sorry, $5 registry reward right there, $10 registry reward. 10 off of two digital, five off digital, and I had a five off of two digital, so I'm sure that came off because then I have another $5 digital right there. So I'm seeing they gave me $20 in L'Oreal coupons. The $5 digital right here is for the Olay, which I really can't complain about because I had way more than $20 on my app, but I'll take the $20 off. That left me um, just $10 to pay because $6 came off on the IVC coupon. So that was definitely a plus. After all of those coupons, my subtotal was $11.69, $16.45 after tax. I got back $26 in cash rewards, 51 everyday coins. So that 10, I got my spend 50, get $10 cash reward back digital booster, spend 25, your $7 back on cosmetics and my paper booster all combined. So last week was just a glitch, just a little, you know, check in the system, I guess it was Sunday. Something was bound to happen. But and then I got back my $5 registry reward for the Olay deal. And how crazy is that? I didn't get a $5 registry reward for the Crest or OLB deal, but I did get it back for the Olay. And I would have used $4 registry rewards that I got off of the Crest deal, but um, I didn't know if it was going to print out a $4 registry reward for the Olay. I thought all of the weekly deals was messed up. But it didn't, it printed off a $5 registry reward. So if you wanted to, you can roll the Oral-B and Crest registry reward onto your Olay deal. If you do your free deal first and then the Olay deal. And you can't use cash rewards or registry rewards from a previous deal if you choose to do that by itself. But I think this worked out pretty good. I spent $16 out of pocket after tax. Got back $26 on Walgreens cash plus a $5 registry reward. I would say that's a win. 
And here's everything I picked up. Y'all, this is a pretty good week. Uh, pretty good day, rather. I'm, I'm trying to do another trip. But they're really, although there's a lot of deals, there really isn't a lot of deals, if you know what I mean. I did do the Crest and Oral-B deal one more time because I wanted us to see what was going to print out again. I just didn't put it up. I have one account where I have the coupons clipped. I don't know, I must have had a brain freeze last night and I didn't clip those $2 digitals to my account. So, and I know I used, uh, I did a Crescent Oral B deal on a couple of other accounts. So I'm not sure if I used the coupons or if I just didn't clip them. But take advantage of those coupons because they do expire on the first. So if you have multiple accounts where you have the $2 Crescent Oral B digitals, go ahead and use them. This will end the week. And hopefully they'll give us new coupons next week. So go ahead and use them up. Tons of laundry deals. I'm going to go back and finish out those because you know I love the laundry deals. Uh, we have the Snuggle, the All, the Purex. And we still have the Scott toilet paper and paper towels. I didn't even mention that because I had so much going on with that spin deal that it was going to be a pretty long video. But I'd like to thank everybody so much for joining me for another video. And I'm going to see you in the next one. Till then, peace. Before I leave, I just want to mention they did end up giving me the $2 in Walgreens cash because I did do the deal twice, um, the Oral-B and Crest deal. So ask for the register rewards. I mean, ask for the cash rewards back if your store only prints out the $4 registry or for your crest and oil.